Hey everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude, and I'm here to review Boyhood. So, Boyhood is written and directed by Richard Linklater. It stars Ellen Coltrane, Lorelai Linklater, Patricia Arquette, and Ethan Hawke. This film is about this boy named Mason, who we get to see grow up throughout the 12 year process. Same thing goes with his sister Sam. And the same could go to his mom, Ethan Hawke. Throughout the 12 years, we see these characters grow up. We get to see them mature and just see where life goes with these characters. So going into Boyhood, I was really intrigued by this film. It took Richard Linklater 12 years to film Boyhood. He actually filmed this movie starting in 2002. Holy crap, you guys. And it's crazy to think about it because anything could have really happened during those 12 years. Like, someone could have died. But now that I've seen Boyhood, what do I really think about the film? Boyhood is one of my favorite films of this year. This is a beautiful movie. It's very well told. It's original storytelling. And here's the thing about this movie. It is 2 hours and 46 minutes. It is a very lengthy movie. And in my humble opinion, I was never bored watching Boyhood. This really is such a remarkable film. The acting from all the actors are all incredible. Every single actor is truly captivating and just really into their roles. Ellen Coltrane does a really good job as the boy named Mason, both when he was young and when he's older. I really cared about his character. And the same could go to his sister, Sam. And for this being portrayed by the director's daughter, Lorelai Linklater, she did a really good job. But it's not just the fact that they grow up, it's interesting to see the parents' point of view. We get to see how Patricia Arquette's character's life goes on throughout the 12 years. How Ethan Hawke, as an adult, matured. I really loved how Richard Linklater just planned out this film. The storyline is beautiful. It's realistic. It's It brings you something that you could really relate to. The directing, beautiful. Richard Linklater does a really good job of just getting you immersed into this very simple world about ordinary life, something us as an audience could really grab onto and relate to. Richard Linklater has these very simple camera shots, nothing too complex or anything. It's just simple, still camera shots, yet he shows it in the most relaxing fashion. Not only does this movie have great life lessons about trying to really find yourself in life, but we get to see from a parent's point of view. Because this movie has a great message about how when you're a parent, you always count your kids first before anyone else. So it actually focuses on when you're a teenager, but also when you're a parent. Any type of music they put in the film really matches that certain scene. And it's music we've heard as we've been growing up. What's also so cool about this film is how it really is grounded in our reality. For example, 2008 was that whole Obama-McCain thing. This film plays that out. There's a scene where a little girl is singing songs from High School Musical. There's a brief scene where the girl is talking to Mason about the Twilight books and how they're cheesy. Or you even see little Mason watch Dragon Ball Z. You see things like that that really make you say, wow, it really sticks with the timeline. And I found that to be very clever. I'm glad Richard Linklater decided to do something like that. And in terms of like the years, how are you going to tell what year they're in? Well, actually, the film doesn't have to tell you. Nor should it, because I think if it did, it would have taken me out of the film a little. Just by seeing how Mason and Sam look, you could already tell what age they're at, what year they're at. Honestly, I gotta say, I have no flaws with Boyhood. This is a really fascinating movie. It is 2 hours and 46 minutes of pure movie magic. And... 
in my opinion, I really mean it when I say that because this is one of the most original films I've seen this year. It's one of the most beautifully told stories of this year. Thanks to the great cinematic genius known as Richard Linklater, who wrote and directed this movie. Ethan Hogg was truly incredible in this film as Mason and Sam's father. I really loved how he matures throughout the film and I gotta say that he is one of my favorite characters of this movie. He didn't have to be too serious or anything like that. He really came off as natural when he played this role and that's why I gotta say this is one of the best performances Ethan Hawke has ever given. Overall, Boyhood is an incredible movie. I loved everything about it. It's 2 hours and 46 minutes, yet I never felt bored watching it. It's something relatable. I'm sure there's going to be at least one thing someone could find relatable in this film, feel very attached to. The characters are well grounded, the cinematography is beautiful, writing and direction is brilliant, music is great, acting is amazing, and it truly has very good thought-provoking messages about life, and by the end of the movie, really make you think, especially with the messages that the film spreads to you. Boyhood, in my opinion, of course, Four out of four stars. It is truly fantastic in my opinion. I can see why this film wouldn't be for everyone though, but if you really love Richard Linklater's style, and if you love just original told stories, then I highly recommend Boyhood. I am 22 Tiger Dude! Don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!